Hello students, it is Miss Nemeth here to talk to you about theme and variation. So theme and variation is kind of like different cookie recipes. So let's say your basic cookie that you make is a chocolate chip cookie and it's really yummy. So you make your chocolate chip cookie dough and you have it and it's all great, but you only take half the dough out of the mixing bowl. And so you bake those chocolate chip cookies and they're delicious and yummy and you have them first. That would be our theme. The main concept that we're trying to deal with is our chocolate chip cookies. The second set would be if we took those chocolate chip cookies and we added walnuts oh, and Miss Nemeth would love cranberries or craisins in there. That would be really good. Or like shredded coconut. You add whatever toppings you want into it or Smarties or M&Ms. And then we bake those again. So we've taken the same theme of our chocolate chip cookies and we've added more into it. So this is our theme and variation. So they're the same cookie mostly, but the variation has added something to it. In music, when we do this, it's the main theme and it's usually at the beginning. So a really great example of this is called Pictures um, at the Exhibition. And so there's this main pomp and circumstance theme that you hear pretty often throughout the whole piece. But at the beginning, it's just one section of the band that plays it, just the woodwinds at the front usually. But later you hear it being played by the trombone or by the bassoon or maybe by the percussion instruments. And they're all a little different. It's mostly the same, but a little different. And that's what we call theme and variation. To vary something means to change it. So that's why it makes sense. But we don't change it so much that we can't recognize it. And that's why we have theme and variation. It's to tie big, long pieces together. So if the piece of music was 45 minutes long and there was nothing that linked any of it together, it would be pretty confusing to listen to. So that's why we have themes that we pull from one section to another and we change them for each section. So I hope you learned a little bit about theme and variation and I really hope you're having a wonderful day. But until next time, I'll see you soon. Bye-bye.